guys what's up it's another day another beat for uzi um yeah we're just still continuing with the pink tape grind uh, making beats for the uzi world's upcoming album and um yeah today i'm gonna show you how i made uh, the beat that you just heard in the beginning um again very infamic very energetic um that's just uh, the vibes i want to go for and um, yeah, I'm gonna break down the beat, show you everything I did, all the sounds, um, yeah, the whole process pretty much. And um, yeah, if you like the video, like, subscribe, comment. Um, if you want to support me, you can go follow me on Instagram as well. Um, all my sound kits are also in the description down below. And yeah, without any more talking, let's jump right uh, into the video. So over here we are in the project for the loop. Um, yeah, I started with the sound uh, from Electra X. It is um, like a, a pad or something. Sounds like this. Um, yeah, my CPU is going crazy again, and I clicked in um, this pattern. So for this pattern, I went for like a two-step um, uh, pattern. Uh, like chord pattern um, as you like might have heard in Myron as well the Uzi song um, and there's also like a genius video from uh, like a beat breakdown from Myron and um, yeah they they also did this like two-step um, pattern for the melody and um, yeah so I just added um, yeah these chords um, and yeah, I just um, put down these chords. So this is a chord, this is a chord, and then here you have um, these chords as well. And then at the end it goes down again. Um, so it goes up and then down again. The root note, uh, like the scale would be A mi E minor. Um, and then it goes up and down. Um, yeah, pretty basic like chords. And then I added um, these melody notes on top um, of the chords um, so like there's more going on and a bit more movement pretty much um, so this is what the first sound sounds like yeah very dope and then I took this uh, melody and I layered it with another sound from Electra X um, the Wisdom Arp from the Martians Electra X bank um, it is the uh, same exact MIDI um, and I just layered it on top of it, the first sound and then together it sounds like this mm -hmm. 
and this is uh, pretty much the like the bass or uh, from the whole beat um like the bass melody and then i have three different counter melodies if you like want to say so um first this vocal chop right here um this is um, like an original vocal chop from one of the hologram kits i think but i put it in fruity slicer and um, put the like slice thing to a beat and then um <laughs> i took the like and then you can like chop it up uh, that's um, what i did so you have all these like individual parts over here from the vocal chop and then you can like chop it up in the way that you want and i did it um, like this yeah so this is the vocal chop mm. nothing too crazy um, and then i added this bell right here as a second counter melody um, yeah pretty like simple pattern and also very repetitive so you have um, this part over here and it just copies over um, and to the second part so there's like um, a bit of variation so it does not get like too boring but uh, still pretty simple and then um, lastly um, I have this I have these strings playing And they really like um, give the whole beat this anthemic orchestral vibe um, and it just like adds a lot of energy as well um, this is um, you can ignore these notes down here um, because this is like the original string pattern um, it goes up and then it goes down again um, yeah just to add a bit, bit of movement and then because for me it sounded too thin if i just left it like that so i copied this whole pattern and pitch it down a whole octave um yeah and these strings are from expand this um, up and down spiccato strings um they're pretty dope and then lastly i also added the church bell again <laughs> yeah and that's um it for the sample pretty much so we can go over uh, to the drums okay over here we are in the project for the drums um, again we have the exported um, loop or the exported sample that I just showed you um, over here and then I started with this 808 um, yeah like pretty simple 808 pattern um, just following the root notes um, nothing too complex and then also um, a very simple clap I also layered this clap with uh, another sound like a snare yeah just to like make it punch even more and then um, some snares just to add a bit of rhythm a bit of bounce um, yeah it's pretty good and then a simple two-step hi-hat nothing crazy at all <laughs> These sounds are all from the hologram um, ki sound kit or drum kit. I think it was version 3. Um, yeah, and then also an open head to finish it up, uh, just at the playing at the beginning. Um, yeah, and then together with the sample, it sounds like this. Uh, yeah pretty full very anthemic energetic and then to like keep the beat going or like to, to make it more fluent i added this riser in the beginning and i also added this um, uh, riser 
uh, I'd like to lead back into the bridge to build up um, some like momentum or some um, energy for the second hook. So arrangement wise, I just have uh, intro and then hook and then the energy um, goes down into the verse. This is the verse and then um, it goes back into the bridge um, and into the second hook and then it just repeats over again. Um, yeah, and that's pretty much it for this video. Um, if you liked it, like, comment, subscribe. Um, yeah, follow my socials like my Instagram. Uh, the link is down in the description. My sound kits as well. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.